The Lansing Housing Commission recently spent millions of dollars to renovate Waverly Place apartments, but there's one problem here. Some residents say those renovations weren't done properly and they deserve some answers to their concerns. We just recently underwent the RAD conversion, but we call it the RAD disaster. RAD is the rental assistance demonstration, and some residents at Waverly Place apartments say their experience with it hasn't been too good. We have plumbing issues, we have electrical issues. Um, the siding is coming off of the side of my newly remodeled RAD conversion townhome. The Lansing Housing Commission started the RAD process in March of 2020 by spending $13.8 million to renovate the 140 units at Waverly. Work included front porches, doors, and more. All of the building exteriors, uh, from siding to, to uh, brick tuck pointing to new front porches, to adding on dormers uh, on the roofs, adding on front porch covers, um, all of the interiors, new flooring, new cabinets, uh, new appliances, all new plumbing fixtures, um, all, you know, drywall repair and paint. We took the residents' concerns to the Lansing Housing Commission's executive director, Doug Fleming, who said he knew nothing about some of the complaints. He also says residents should understand that minor issues are common after a large renovation project. Anytime you have a construction deal, you're always gonna have some what we call punch list items, things that we're gonna finish up. Things are gonna come loose, things are gonna you know, need to be adjusted, fixed. Um, you know, when you put in uh, 140 new refrigerators, some of them are gonna go bad. Um, and so all we can do is like we always do is that once a resident calls us and says, hey, I have a work order, we'll go in and we'll fix that. But residents say they've complained for years. My handicapped daughter, she can't walk, she can't climb, she can't do any of that. I've been asking for a ramp so my daughter can get her wheelchair out the apartment. They, I, they've been supposed to put me a ramp going on two years now and the ramp is still not up. They say they have it in their garage and they're supposed to put it up on a nice day. It's been several nice days and my ramp's still not up. Aside from Waverly, the Lansing Housing Commission hopes to renovate three other apartments in the city by the end of 2023. We're told renovating all four properties is going to cost around $50 million and the renovations were made possible with the help of tax credits. But residents at Waverly say before moving on to other renovations, the Lansing Housing Commission should fix their issues First, fix these apartments the correct way because we have to live out here. For now, I'm your Southside Lansing neighborhood reporter here in Lansing, Larry Wallace, Fox 47 News.